Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for joining me today. This week I'm doing something a little different. I'm bringing you a Dollar Tree haul. I'm not going to hesitate. Let's just get into it because I cannot believe what I found. So I go to my local Dollar Tree and I am surprised by what I found. I stumbled across disc bound planners. It all started with these discs. These are the large discs that they sell separately for the disc bound planner. And a disc bound planner is very much like what they sell at Staples, the ARC brand, at Michaels and Joann's and Hobby Lobby and even online there's Happy Planner. There's also Martha Stewart. There's several different ones out there. I think Levenger is another one that sell disc bound planners. I am a Happy Planner. I love Happy Planner products and when I saw this I had to grab it up. Let's check it out. Let's see what all we've got in here and then we're going to open it up and actually see the quality. So I went ahead and got two of everything that I could find. They had this all on an end cap, very well done, but some of the items were obviously already sold out. So um, let's just see what all we have here. These are the actual planners. It says that you get with it personal info page, non-dated months, removable pages, obviously. Um, all right. So it comes with some pages because it says 20 sheets. We'll have to open that up and see. And I've got two different designs there. I also got the tabs in the two different designs. I picked up stickers. These are called planner patches. And they're really large metallic foil. They're like hollow foil stickers. It's pretty cool. I got a couple of those. Then I found customizable planner covers. This one has sunglasses and it looks like watermelon. And this one is stripes. And oh look at that. It's got the wood grain on the back. That's really nice. I love anything that is farmhouse. Um, I got the tabs in both styles. And I picked up some extra pages. Let's see. I got the weekly sheets, two of those, um, one monthly sheet. I'm not sure that I love the monthly sheets, but we'll show I'll show you that. And a couple of these note pages. And they did have the um, planner disc in two sizes. They had the large and they had the small. Now they didn't have the small in black, but that's okay because I have the small in black on the actual planner itself. So let's just grab some of this up. I'm gonna flip things over and hopefully the camera is gonna focus. So you can actually grab the SKU numbers if you're interested in finding these and they don't have them at your Dollar Tree. I did look online when I got home. Um, I was went to DollarTree.com and looked online to see if they had them in the new products and they did not. The planner patches. other style, the good vibes only. We have the extra monthly sheets, the extra weekly sheets. Hopefully that's focusing. The tabs for the floral, good vibes only. The tabs for the polka dot. The striped planner covers. It says there's two sets in here, so I'm going to open that up and actually see what it is. And the watermelon. And then these are the other tabs. So that's all of the products. Let's go ahead and open this up. I think I want to see this first 
and let's see what's in the um, the planner covers too. Let's open those up. The sheets are pretty self-explanatory, I do believe. I'm just going to pile all that up, and then we'll get this out of the way, and let's get into it. What comes with this little planner kit? For a dollar. I mean, really. I, I just, I can't believe it's a dollar. All right, so... The covers are, are thin. They are plastic. They don't feel like laminated paper. They just feel plastic. One side is smooth um, or matte and the other side is shiny. And it's got a personal information page. Three, six, seven discs. I'm going to grab my Happy Planner Mini. And let's take a look at my mini compared to this. Okay, the discs line up, so that means that the pages are likely going to line up with the discs. That is really good to know. This is a little bit bigger as far as the cover goes, but I don't think that the pages are. Let's see. No, the pages are pretty much the same size. So there it is in my Happy Planner. There we go. So nice comparison there. I love that it's that size. That means that my note paper for the Happy Planner is going to fit as well. So you open it up and you have personal information. And then it goes straight into the monthly. Um, the monthly view is really a little different. So you have, it's, it's kind of hard to read because it's blue on blue two different shades of this aqua blue which the color is pretty but it's not um, it's not super easy to read and everything is across the side here you actually would circle what month it is tell it the day and you date it yourself with a Sunday start it's got a place on the side for notes um, and so your whole month is on this one page and then you flip it around the other way to see your next month so that's a little different see how many of these you get. That was two stuck together I believe. Yes. Alright, so you get enough to do the 12 months. So that's kind of cool. And all right, on the back of it starts your actual weekly view. So I'm interested in using the dividers. So let's pop open the dividers and have a look at them real quick. So, we will come over here where it says monthly and pop one of these in. It matches the polka dots, the black polka dots. There's no pink on this one. And it's kind of the same, I don't know, it's a heavy cardstock. It definitely has a plastic feel to it. It's not laminated. And then we're going to start the weekly. Love the stripes. Love stripes, love polka dots. And so you just get a smattering of that. Oh, there are some note pages too. Okay. Note pages. And then you have Hello with the Marble, Marble and Pink Split, and Small Polka Dots with the Pink Tab. I really like these. Those are cute. So let's go ahead and just pop all of them in. These discs are definitely thicker than a Happy Planner disc. The, out, the, the inside diameter feels thicker, and the outside is definitely thicker. I don't know if you can really see that. And let's have a look at these covers. I 
thinking I could just make me a little farmhouse notebook. I would love that. So we have, okay, we have the stripes. Both sides are stripes, one shiny, one matte. And then we have the wood. It looks like it's got pen all over it. I don't know, let me grab an eraser. See, I can get that off. Yeah, it's coming off. Somebody must have just gotten into the package. But it's coming off with my gum eraser. So that's kind of cool. I'm not loving that it has 2020 on the front of it, but I can come in here with one of these stickers and put something over the front of it. Oh, look at this kindness counts. That's cute. I like that. It says create. Hello, you got this. And it looks like so she did maybe. I'm trying to see it through the through the package. Never give up. Good vibes only. Make today count and kindness counts. All right. And let's see the other choices. The other two covers. Obviously one of them is watermelon. So this one with the sunglasses has tiny light blue polka dots all over it, which is really kind of cute. I don't think that's showing up in the camera. I don't know that that's focusing. Um, but you get the matching back and then you've got the watermelon. Really cute. Super, super cute. Alright, so let's come over here and do a little surgery. Let me grab my tape runner. And open up this notes. And right here on the back of the page that actually says the information like your personal information. I'm gonna go ahead and have that at the front. So I'm just gonna go ahead and sticky this note page right to the back of it. Like so. And then I'm gonna do the same thing at the end of the monthly pages, even though I'm covered a monthly up. I'm going to put a note page there. Stick that down. And then the weekly goes, has a notes on the back of it. And then I have a note section. So let's go ahead and put some of this paper in the notes section. I was thinking I would need to put this on the bigger disc, but this is really, really thin. Um, let's put in the weekly pages. It is a horizontal layout. It is undated, so you can start it whenever you want to start it, and um, that is really kind of cool. It starts on a Thursday. I don't love that, so I'm going to do the same thing, and we're going to pop in a notes page on the front of that. And I find it's easier to line them up. Oh, except I did not line that up. It's easier to line them up um, when you have a page laying down Make sure it's in the disc right, because that one is not. And then you just fold it over on itself like so. And the edges line up pretty good. That's all I care about at this point. So then we have that. Probably don't need to use all of this to 
put the weekly pages in because I can always change it out like I do my other planners. But this is on the small disc and there is a lot of room left in that. A lot of room. All right, let's have a look really quick at these other set of dividers. If I can get it to open. And I'll go ahead and grab the other planner too. And let's just have a look. It shows on the front of this a stencil, so I'm wondering if that's part of the um, part of what comes in this line. I don't know. It appears to be, yeah, it's Greenbrier International, so this is actually a Dollar Tree product. It's not something that they've brought in from elsewhere, and um, that's kind of cool. Makes me think it might stick around a little bit. Here we have enjoy the little things. Oh, the back is different. Okay. So enjoy the little things. Then weekly says find beauty in all things. Notes says focus on the good. And it's pink on the back. And then we have pink florals. Oh, okay. I get it. That matches. Cute. And we have a different floral and this one that's really cute good job dollar tree for a dollar i mean that's just crazy i bought two of everything that i could find two of and i don't think that i spent twenty dollars i don't think i got 20 items yet so that is pretty cool and again let's go ahead and just compare it to the size of a mini happy planner. The cover itself is a little bit larger, as you can see. I have it lined up where the discs match. Um, just barely, barely bigger, like a quarter of an inch. And the pages appear to be the same size, and the disc placement is the same size, but you can really see the difference in the size of those discs. This is a lot wider around, this, around the edge. However, it doesn't seem to be giving me any trouble with turning pages. I mean, they are flipping like super, super easy. So I like it. I give this one a thumbs up for sure. And I hope you like this video. Hope it's inspired you to grab your planner and get some planning done. And if you did like this video, please do give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button down below. Go over and click that little bell. Pick in the drop down menu the option that you like so that you can be notified each time that I upload new videos because I would love to have you come along for the fun. Remember, be good to yourselves, be good to each other, and happy planning.